After nine months, Sumter's Ward 1 now has a voting representative. Anthony Gibson was sworn into City Council tonight. Sam Perez met up with Gibson to hear about his plans for the area. My communities love harmony and a group effort. How Derek Ford describes how he sees Sumter's Ward 1, an area of the city that he's lived in his whole life. It's an area that hasn't had a voting city council member since November. During that lapse time, we have a lot of concern in my community and a lot of situations that was not being handled. But now that legal challenges about the election results have been dismissed by the South Carolina Supreme Court, Anthony Gibson is being sworn in. When you lose nine months of your uh, term, that's frustrating. So now the focus is forward movement. Gibson has lived in Ward 1 for 17 years, serves as a pastor for Grace Cathedral, and works in real estate. Gibson tells me he is ready to take on his new role as city councilman. We have a whole lot of work to do. We want to make sure that Sumter is a place that when people come and see the area, it's beautiful and they want to stay and you know, raise their families here. And also uh, making sure that we're drawing in new businesses with, with better pay and uh, help change people's lives and enhance their quality of life. To do that, Gibson says his first priority is safety after hearing concerns from residents. Almost every conversation I heard something about public safety. People on this street are driving like 60 miles an hour in the afternoons and no one's being stopped. Lula Dow lives in Ward 1 and says safety is a top concern for her, as well as beautification efforts. With Gibson focused on helping with those issues, Dow tells me she's hopeful for the future. I'm feeling positive. Faith without work and hope is no good. So I have hope and I have faith. So things are going to work out, I believe. For Street Squad Sumter, Sam Perez, News 19 WLTX.